The sun will be shining on center court this weekend. Chris Crocker is there now with what HoopFest has in store. And Chris, what can people expect? Well, I am here at Center Court, and we've got sunshine in one direction, some dark clouds in the other, and for about the next 24 hours, there is a slight chance of showers, but mainly over the Northeast Mountains and North Idaho. I want to show you we've got Nike Center Court covered up with a tarp for the time being. They were asking me, do you think we could take this tarp off for a 7 o'clock event here? And I think that they're going to be fine. I do want to show you. It's got this, like, cool graffiti theme that you are going to see throughout Hoop Fest this year. It's on the backboard here at Center Court on the merchandise and uh, we are going to have so much fun down here this weekend and the weather is going to be perfect. Tonight there is a slight chance of a few sprinkles in the overnight with an overnight low tonight of 53 degrees. For tomorrow, mostly cloudy skies, a slight chance of isolated showers and thunderstorms. Again, the best chance will be in the Northeast Mountains and North Idaho, but can't rule out a sprinkle or two from about 10 o'clock tomorrow morning till about 4 o'clock tomorrow afternoon here in Spokane. Temperatures right now in Spokane, we have dropped into the upper 60s. We are also in the upper 60s in Coeur d'Alene with a little bit of a breeze. Uh, we have wind gusts in the 20 mile per hour range. Uh, our almanac today, we made it up to 72, a little below average, and a drop from the 79 of yesterday. Doppler radar shows some showers around the region in the Northeast Mountains and North Idaho. Those will continue this evening and even through the overnight uh, as an upper level display disturbance makes its way over the region. That's going to keep things cool and unsettled for tomorrow as well on our big view of the satellite and radar. There's a lot more action east of here over Montana. and We could still see a lightning strike or two over the next 24 hours, but then we are sailing into a quiet hoop fest weekend. Overnight lows tonight will be down in the 40s and 50s. High temperatures tomorrow mostly in the 60s and 70s. Could get up close to 80 in Moses Lake. Your seven-day forecast keeps temperatures a little below average right on through Hoop Fest weekend, right on through the 4th of July on Wednesday. One note on Saturday, we may have the winds picking up a little bit Saturday afternoon and evening. Wind gusts in the 20, 25 mile per hour range. I don't think that's going to bother anybody. Just cool you off after a hot game. And of course, those temperatures are airport temperatures. Once you bring the Bring yourself down to downtown Spokane amongst the buildings, the urban heat island, the thousands of people, and the blacktop, and a lower elevation. You can uh, add a few degrees uh, to those numbers out at the airport, Nadine.